for Katie Chats here at Technicolor in downtown Toronto with Marilla Wex and Nikki Payne. How does it feel to have the WBI in the Pitch This competition? Um, I'm pretty amazed simply because we I finished working on it in January and then the next thing I knew we were in the competition so I was like what <laughs> so I'm thrilled yeah basically all I do is hump things for a living on stage so I really didn't think that the kids would ever take anything seriously that I ever wrote so I somehow fell through the cracks and I'm happy we brought you a pin too you have a button it's a WBI a button oh great thank you so much You're very welcome thank you um how are you preparing for your six minute pitch tomorrow we're running the lines and laughing like demented gibbons <laughs> Yeah, we're like 14 year like we were well your cameraman saw us. We were in the lobby and we were like 14 year old girls because we're really tired now. And so like he walked out and we were like <laughs> <laughs> What is at the heart of the story? Um, women behaving badly. Um, take bridesmaids and multiply it by at least five and a half in the bad behaviour stakes. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's one part bridesmaids couple parts um that that movie with the what's that movie the social media social media no, social and then the, and the other one the, um, hangover. hangover that's the one i'm so tired i just screwed that question up completely i'm sorry and what's it like working with four women I, actually it's a lot of talking over one another that's mainly what it is <laughs> yes <laughs> I'm not screwing up another you question. You just disproved Katie, my point. I, Thanks. I, <laughs> no, I was just talking over you while okay. you said that. What? Yeah. What? And is the script based largely on your own experiences, or do you improv situations? How do you come up with? How have you come up with the story? We took it from the characters, so um, we designed the characters to to basically work together or not work together or irritate each other and then the situations build out of that so you're not trying to impose any kind of set piece on a character you're saying what would the character do in this situation so we start off with the premise and then we take it from there yes <laughs> what she said yeah no because when you take the characters and you know what they're about and you know what sets them off and doesn't then you can start going okay well what would really set this person off and then you start building a scene from there and how has working as a stand-up comic for so many years helped you with the writing process well you always write your own material so it's slightly different because you're writing from the perspective of a different character but you're used to writing and writing on the fly and changing stuff constantly so that's helpful. Yeah and you're used to people not liking your stuff like I mean because you find out immediately as a stand up whether or not something's funny or not right so you learn to live with the fact that sometimes you're funny sometimes you're not and um, and that helps in the in the writing process when you're like well what if this happened and everybody went no and, and, <laughs> right right I didn't mean that that I got wasn't really a good idea. And what was it like winning the Canadian Comedy Person of the Year award? It was crazy. I didn't think that I was going to win. So when they called my name, my shoes were off already. And I was just sort of relaxing and enjoying the evening. And they called my name, and I had to try to get my shoes on. And, and I didn't have a speech. That's a lesson out there, kids. Even if you think you're going to lose, write a speech, just in case, or you're going to look like a dork. And where's the best place to find out more information on you both and on the project online? Well, the WBI.com is the uh, website for the movie. I can be found at MarillaWex.com. I can be found at NikkiPayne.com and on Facebook. Well, thank you so much, and best of luck at Pitch This Tomorrow. You're welcome. Thanks. Thank you. I'm Katie Ullman, reporting for Katie Chats here at Technicolor in downtown Toronto. Great. <laughs> That's how you end an interview. <laughs> you stay in the same spot.